Let's create this mobile animation on PowerPoint. So first open up your PowerPoint, get a blank slide, go to insert, go to shapes and pick this frame and just drag it over there. Boom, our frame is ready. I'm just expand it a bit so that you can see it clearly. Done. Then I'll go to shape outline, click on no outline so the outlines will disappear and go to shape fill and make this black color. Done. Then I'll go to insert again, go to shape again and pick this rectangle and just drag it over there. Then I'm just going to click on these two icons so that it just matches with the other slide. Alright, done. Then I'll go to insert again and pick this rounded rectangle and just drag it over there. Boom done and you will see that there's a yellow dot over here just drag it over and smooth it out a bit done i'm just gonna put it right over here and make it white done and i'm gonna, just gonna press ctrl shift and drag it right over here and just make it roundish so that it becomes the button done our mobile is ready then i'm just drag over all of it right click and then go to group and group it all together done our mobile set is ready now for the slides i'll go to insert i'll go to shape and i'll pick this round uh, rectangle only and just drag it over there it would be a size above the frame so that you know it becomes a screen now i'm just put it right over here click on this show no outline and go to shape fill and make go more fill colors and i'll make this this color all right done the powerpoint pro color all right, done. Then what I'll do is insert, go to Word Art and type maybe, you know, PowerPoint. <laughs> I don't know, like, what can I type? PowerPoint Pro. PowerPoint Pro. Pro. All right, done. Our PowerPoint Pro is typed. I'm just gonna go to home. I'm gonna press on this S so that shades will disappear. And I'm just decrease the size a bit. And to make it seen clear i'm just go over here and make it white and i'll just make this the heavy chest font the powerpoint pro font done <laughs> then i'm just click on this hole and right click then group it done what i'm going to do also is click on shapes and pick another one and just make it this size and put it right over here then i'm going to press on this so the outlines will disappear and go to shape fill and make it this color this color and make it and go shapes and I'll pick this box and just I'm gonna drag it over there done I'm gonna press on this the outlines will disappear and go to shape fill I'll make this why what color can I make it uh, how about this color how about this color and why not make the background a bit yep this color and what I'm gonna type over here uh, I'm gonna go to insert go to sorry word and pick this and I'm gonna try it. think outside the box think outside the box all right think outside the box with the exclamatory then I'm just gonna minimize it a bit yep done and I'm gonna make the font here with us done I'm gonna press on this S so the shades will disappear and minimize it a bit and make it white or maybe black so that it pops up all right done and I'm just drag it all over it and right click then group and group it all together so we got our two slides ready now what I'm gonna do is just click on this two go to animation and click fly in so both of these just fly in in the scene what I'm gonna do is click on this animation pen and click on this triangle and go to effect options and I'm gonna press smooth end so this happens it smooths a little bit then I'm gonna increase the duration to one second and I'm gonna say with previous so with previous both of this come and smooth it out a bit then what I'm gonna do is just click on this the second part and delay it for yep two seconds let's see what happens first this comes then this comes all right done now what I will do is just drag this two and just place them over the screen all right now click on the mobile right click bring to front bring it to front and this will become the screen then play the slide pop on pro 
and think outside the box. So our slide animation is ready. To make it more professional, we need to make it not seen in this part. I'll just go to insert, go to shape, I pick this rectangle, I'm going to drag it over there and I'm going to decrease the size and click on this so the outlines will disappear and make the shape white. And let's see what happens. PowerPoint Pro and think outside the box and that's how you make an app slide on PowerPoint. Thanks for watching. For more of these videos, don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe to this YouTube channel.